and Alex Palom already finishes fourth today and, and that doesn't really tell the whole story went to the back at one point after starting on the pole so on a day like this where you have one of the best cars but you fight back to a fourth place finish how do you evaluate that um, tough day it was a tough day for myself and for the team but um, anyway nothing we could have done differently there on pit lane um, we had a really fast car as you guys so and from that point we just switched our minds uh, we were starting from 30th again and we had to start the race from scratch so uh, tried to make the most of it was a bit lucky with uh, the restarts there um, that allowed me to push forward but yeah anyway shows that we made it with 100 laps from 30th to 4th and we could have done a bit more but uh, it's this place, man. It's tough. It's tough for everybody. Uh, we'll keep on knocking that door and come back stronger next year. Do you feel like you had the best car today? Well, there were some really strong cars as well. We had one of the best cars for sure. Otherwise, I wouldn't have made it back to P4. But there were some really strong cars, the 5, the 6, the 2, the 8. I didn't run with him, but I know he had a strong car as well. But uh, yeah, I have one of the best for sure. Uh, we didn't finish fourth uh, because we had the slow car, so. All right, it's another top five at Indy for Alex Polo, fourth today. Hi, folks, Lee Diffie from NBC Sports here. If you truly enjoyed what you just watched, you can get more news, interviews, and highlights by subscribing to the Motorsports on NBC YouTube page. You can get it all, so go for it.